we fool people. This is Uncle Code here, and I do have something very interesting for you. What if I tell you that with the help of the Grok and their help you, you can build almost a real-time voice assistant with some little tricks. Let's watch the video first, and then I will explain it. Hello, Garvis. Uh, I have a question. I want to know that why black holes exist. A cosmic mystery. Black holes form when massive stars collapse under gravity. They're dense. Okay, understand that. I hear that there are some hypotheses that we're all living in a black hole. What do you think about it? The holographic principle. Some theories suggest our universe is a 3D boundary of a higher dimensional space like a black hole. It's a mind. Very interesting. I noticed that you're so fast in the way that you respond to my question. May I know how you built what make you so fast? Grux LPU chip. It's the secret to my speed. Built on a novel architecture, LPU enables parallel processing at unprecedented scales, making me a lightning fast conversational AI. Yeah, you bet you are. Fantastic. Welcome back again here, you beautiful people. How was it? I really love it. It's so nice that you can get the speech to text recognition so fast. It's not a kind of real time or streaming speech to the text because Grok released Whisper model, the large size. And I, I wondered if they release the small size, it's going to be even faster. But but you can do some tricks to get such a kind of real time uh, speech to text and build some really good application. What if down here I created a co core applications and async library? And to be honest, it has been years I created desktop apps, all, always been. <laughs> um web and this time when i wanted to sync this with the sync it was a little bit difficult but anyway if you are good in the disk come and then improve it what i did was i built this core library that captured the sound from the music then it has something called listening strategy design pattern if you go to the folder of the jarvis i have to make it to the garvis i know why it's j and then uh you're gonna find the listening strategy here there are a bunch of different strategies for example one strategy is simply record five seconds and take it and then bring it back another strategy is to continue till detect a silent and i try to just use pi audio not that a speech recognition library or anything else just just pi audio and mating and managing the silence by myself another strategy is to just keep recording and whenever there's a tiny silent use that chunk send it to grok and grok is super fast and get it back and then continue and streaming basically the speech to text recognition which is what i use and that is a sort of real-time recognition right but anyway you can you can go and play around with it and there are some library like the uh core sync and also i worked a little bit with some concept that see if we can do some sort of semantic router to know that this is the end of your conversation. But for now, the one that I use is waiting for, for, for a silent. But also I created something experimental that listened and guessed it. Okay, now, now I have to answer. If you want to play around with it, you can go in the rotors and then see there are some uterines and, and I use this beautiful semantic rotor library, but you can build up your own. The, the point is I made it in a way that you can, you can plug in your strategies with it. And uh, there is an audio processor, which is doing the lifting the heavy parts. And there are some uh, parameters like a thresholds, frame size, and you're going to do that. For now, I didn't have enough time to really create a cool readme. So it's just a simple one, but I'm going to work on it and then improve it. So, and also I can go to the example folders. There are two examples. One is a terminal, which is just a terminal apps using as an example of that one is very heavily based on, on, on the even model so it means there are a bunch of events like untranscription starts untranscription stop or untranscription update same when transcription is down then LLM start to come to the game right LLM start stop update and then text to speech start and stop so you can have control in all these events if you wanted and then play around with them uh and then 
yeah that's it so i released this one it's just in my github repository you can play around with it and i will work on this and improve it so i hope you're gonna have fun with it and uh, let me know your feedback by the way you got the initial music was a kind of game of thrones yeah that, that's i just wanted to say <laughs> that's it have fun uncle code out